We are back with some more Colts franchise coming off of a very, very tough loss against the Tennessee Titans. Um, in week 14, we did end up re-signing our right outside linebacker, our backup linebacker, Zaire. I think that's how you say his first name, Franklin. Three years, 7.05 million. He's like 25 or 26 right now, so got him locked up as a solid little backup outside linebacker for us for a few years. Um, a lot of you guys were upset with me declining the um, roughing the kicker penalty. I'm going to be honest. I'm not sure if they fixed that. I know there was a thing at the beginning of this Madden where if you didn't use her, the outside guy, there was like almost a guaranteed top chance. Like almost, it was almost guaranteed that your the CPU would run into the kicker. Um, so I've just been declining those ever since the beginning because I thought it was kind of cheap. Uh, but after some further thought, you know, I talked to a couple people about it. Um, I'm going to start accepting those every time. I mean, if you're not going to use the cor the guy there and make sure you don't run into the kicker, then it is what it is. I'm going to start accepting him. It's your own fucking fault for not doing it. Um, I mean, I, at first I thought it was cheap to do that, but after further thought, it's like, I mean, it takes him literally, it doesn't take him any effort to not have the CPU do that. So... Going to be accepting those moving on. Just uh, I know a lot of people in the comments were upset about that. That's how the division is currently looking. Titans have yet to play here in Week 14. He is 9-3. and three. I am 8-4. and four. Um, We'll take a look at the some injuries. You might have saw something crazy there. But uh, Costanzo, he's back in two more games. The 49ers have a big-time injury here with Richard Sherman dislocated elbow. Um, he will not be playing today, so that's a big time loss for him. The 49ers are sitting at six and six, and I believe it's either first in the division or like a game behind him. So the 49ers definitely in the playoff race. So this should be a pretty entertaining game here. We got a rookie quarterback, Clayton Burris, starting over Jimmy G. Raheem Mostert, who's got so much speed, and Kyle Uzcheck, who is a monster. Debo Samuel, Brandon Ayuk, Dante Pettis, Kendrick Bourne. I mean, those are some solid wide receivers along with. A legend at tight end, um, George Kittle. Trent Williams. I mean, the offensive side is pretty loaded, if you ask me. Um, his offensive line, the left side looked pretty good. Right side, you know, it's not that bad. Defense, Nick Bosa at right end, or left end. Eric Armstead at right end. And then we got Javon Kinlaw, um, the rookie in real life, playing in the middle there. Um, and then we got Fred Warner, who's an absolute legend. I mean, the defense is crazy. This team is really, really solid, man. No Richard Sherman's really going to hurt him, though, obviously. Tedrick Thompson um, playing that free safety spot. And Jimmy Ward at strong safety. So that is his team. Um, we have a breakout player for Jacob Eason, which is just blows my mind. He played pretty good. With, I did pretty, he did pretty good last week. Obviously through that inaccurate pick at the very, very end and then went down the tie to send the OT. But, um, yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm, I've heard these breakout quarterback chances are hard. We'll take a look at the playoff picture. Nothing's really changed on the AFC side. I haven't really been paying attention to the NFC side. But from last week, nothing's really changed um, besides these two got flipped. I mean, last week I was the third. Tennessee was the sixth seed. And now I'm the sixth and he's the third. So, um, not sure... What his what the tiebreakers are because I think in divisions it's head to head first which we split and then I'm pretty sure it's division record for divisional tiebreakers which his only divisional loss is to me and my only divisional loss is to him um, so we split that and then I believe it's common opponents or something like that I'm not too sure um, but hopefully he can drop a game we'll see. Uh, we just got to handle our business. I, I'm not going to be looking at other games really too much. We got to we got to at least make the playoffs, man. We've had a couple rough losses this season, so we just got to make the damn playoffs at this point. But this could be very helpful if we can somehow pull this off. I know it's pretty crazy. We got what we got to do here. 325 total passing and rushing yards, four plus total touchdowns, zero interceptions, and the win. So Jacob Eason's got to come out on point, slinging it. I mean, no Richard Sherman. It's there for us to do it. We just got to play good, taking on the 49ers, and let's see if we can get a win. By himself, and he backed up. Well. Right there, Deontay. Good catch, boy. His defensive line is legendary. Second and ten. Yes, sir. 
Yes, sir, Pittman. Let's go. Give me that, man. Oh, yeah. I gotta be covered, too. No? Yep. Perfect. With a clean pocket. That's what we like to see. That's how we want to start off the game, man. Let's go. Um, I'll be Darius Slider. I'm going to send George Kittle's side. Picked. Oh, yeah, Jabril. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Thank you. This is how we want to start off the game. Go down and get seven. Jabril gets a pick six. Let's fucking go, man. This is what we needed. I wish we played like this yet last last week. Gotta lock up on George Kittle. Darius Leonard cannot guard this dude by himself, so. Another run, huh? Oh, what a fucking cutback. Jesus. I'm not worried about these these man these people out here. Well, on George Kittle. Come on, got him on over the top. Please don't get roasted deep. Oh, we're there. Rocky Sin. Let's go! Yes! Let's fucking go, man. Come on, Rocky Sin. Let's go. This is absolutely brilliant here. Run some play action. Oh, JT wide open. JT! Oh, yeah! Let's see if I can get one of these post routes. Second and eight. Good throw. Alright, third and five. I'm going to put Deontay... Out wide here. See if he can just burn him off the rip there. No. Oh, it's there! No! JT! Or maybe I, I, I shifted left just slightly. And, uh... That's what fucked us there. Because it was there. That was wide open right there. Third and four. I'm going to beat Jabril over here in this, where all these receivers are at. That's mine. Oh, we used it. Damn, I thought I was hopping it with Jabril. I thought I was mine. Miley Cox, what button is he? A? Okay. What a throw. What a throw. I'm actually going to run again. Let's do it again. There we go. There we go. Come on, boys. We got to get some more points. Got to get more points. Did put P.I.? Oh, yeah. Thank you, ref. Thank you. Put me at the one. Hey, out here... Draw on some holding calls. That's what you love to see. Fuck, dude. What is that, holding? Oh, my God. Holding call is killer. We can't be getting holding calls like that. Yeah, that threw a pick. Threw a fucking pick trying to force it, man. That's what you love to see right there. Good tackle. No breakout chance. Fuck, dude. The one time I get a breakout chance, I, f I thought he, I thought there was enough where I could high pass that behind him because they were all like sitting at the goal line. God damn it. Oh, well, it'd be nice to get a three and out out of this though, at least. Nice to get him off the field. That's mine, or not, or not. Um, let's do this actually. I'm gonna keep JT in. Good throw. Play action's been working really well too. So I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep going to it. Good throw. We probably won't need you this game, so thank god it wasn't long term. Thank god. Sacked. Ooh, X wide open. But by the time he got open, it was pretty much too late at that point. Well, that's unfortunate.
I'm, I am happy that Quentin's fine, though. Thank God that man is... We can't afford that to be a long-term injury. I'm going to be out here this time. Uh-uh. Oh, George Kittles of God, dude. Just mossed me. That is for sure. Play action. I ain't fooled. Come here, boy. Damn. Oh, that would have helped out for his development so much. Getting a superstar. That would have been brilliant, man. What I wanted to do. But I think I'm actually going to stick with it. I'm going to stick with it. Third and six. I'm on George Kittle. He's just going to run it. What the hell? What? He had to have thought he was running a play action play or something. No way he ran that and that's what he decided to do. There's no way. He had to have think that was a play action play or something there, man. Jeremy Chin. Is that his name? I think that's his name. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, gone. I'm gone, boy. Come on, JT. Damn it. All right. Don't throw a pick. I'm trash at RPOs, but... Okay. I made the right decision. There we go. I need a touchdown. I'm tired of getting field goals. Last two have been field goals. I'm looking for seven here. Don't fumble. Oh, my God. Yes. Just came out of nowhere, and he's just dominating, dominating everyone. Get there, Jacob. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's what we like to see. A little play action. We'll just rush our way on in there. Beautiful. Third and nine. Will be Malik. Come down here and probably help out on George. So I don't be. Yes, thank you. I thought I was gonna get pi. We got time. We got time. Let's do. Let's go get some more. Damn it! I was gonna check it down to JT. He had so much room. Don't think we're picking this one up. Third and eighteen. We'll see. Get big. Oh, the grown man. Damn it. Where's George? Let me show him who the real man's at. I'm a real, the real thug. Oh, what a... Sit down. Oh, you're lucky, Debo. You're lucky. Third and seven. We got Malik Cooker coming out of blitz. I got this drag. Wow, what a throw. Let's be... I'm going to be out here. I'm going to be in this purple. Alright, the one time I'm not sitting in the middle, man. That's what we'd like to see from the man. Jabril Pepper's best strong safety in Madden. Screen. Oh, on a screen? I just bailed him out so hard. I should have swatted, but I was get, I got greedy. I'm gonna try, man. We'll play the insides. Oh yeah, I, what just happened? It warped me into that because I, I I I thought he was throwing to George, and I hit Y, and it just like suctioned me into breaking that up. Oh my god, I'll take it, man. I'll take it. Third and five. I'm hoping Colby might get open here. Or Big Mo. Big Mo running down the sideline. Look at him go. Yes, let's go, man. Mo Alley Cox, 70 yard touchdown. That's what we like to see. Cover two, man. I've, I've been really dominating when people run cover two. Cover two is just. 
I don't know. That coverage is just really suspect. We are just on fire, man. Why can't we do this consistently? Seriously. Oh, good throw. Good throw. I'm doing it. I'm going to be on Debo. Third and eight. Oh, yes. Who got in there? Who got? Who was that? I'm not sure who got in there, but good shit, man. Oh, that's Kenny Moore. There we go. Third and six. Let's see what we got here. Big Mo. He's always open. Third and eight. It's going to be a difficult one here. This will be a difficult one, I think. I might have a touchdown. Oh, my God. He's got and done it. Oh, no. Oh, no. He just was sleeping on that safety. The safety just fell asleep. The man just fell asleep with that safety, dude. And Paris Campbell running down the side. I'm going to miss this, aren't I? Thank God. Um, I don't fucking know. It's being Malik, I guess. Why not? Caught me slipping in cover two again. Oh, my. George G. Oh, my God. I'm going to man him up on the running back there. will be Darius. Sit down here. Oh, I missed my head stick. Dang it. Let's go. No touchdowns ever. We're not allowing anything, man. Get in there. Oh, that was way too easy. Damn it. Oh, well. It was bound to happen. I'm still happy with how the defense has played. Have, have, we haven't got too many sacks, but we've got the turnovers. We're getting them off on third down, so I'll take it. Ooh, Pittman could be open. Good catch, boy. Actually, reset here. I'm going to stay on the weak side. I'm going to stay on the weak side, Damien. First down. Oh, way to stick the ball out. Okay. So I'm forced it in the red zone. I didn't even need to make that throw, but third and nine. Cooked. Let's go, Deontay. Who knows? I got everything else besides the the pick. I mean, they should be. I, I wish. I hope they get hyped. Uh oh. I'm just gonna cut in. I was trying not to score, man. Thank you. I'm trying to milk this clock. Finish it out. Oh, look at Damien. Okay. Damien Harris finding his way to get in there. That's what we like to see. Second touchdown for the man. Close off. I, I said I wanted to get it through on the six tonight. I was pretty close. We were pretty close. We were almost there. We black, man. Okay, nothing deep. We'll sit back here. Good defense, guys. Good defense. We got really good pressure, too. I mean, if we're only rushing forward, we got in there quick. Which is exactly what we want from our front four, man. Just freaking getting in there. He's going for it. He said, book it. I'm going. We'll be Malik. This is a little yellow right here. Wide open. Dang it. We'll play the insides. I'll be on Georgie. Uh-oh. 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 I'm fucking up. Okay, I'm on Malik. Malik's on him. Let's go. I'm assuming he's going to go for it again. I mean, he went for it last time, so... Look at Puna. Puna's having a hell... Oh, he's going to punt it this time? Okay. Alright. We find a way to pick this one up. It is GG. We can need out. Let's see. Come on, Pittman. Oh, I don't know if I got it, man. Please tell me I got it. Dude. No way. Oh, that's fucking brutal, man. That's brutal. We're really up the punt right here. Oh, no. Don't let him get a free touchdown. No. Come on, defense. Don't do it. Don't give in. 
Don't do it now. Oh, wow. Jesus. Roby Coleman. Wow. Okay. Roby Coleman deciding he did not want to play defense <laughs> the rest of this game. He said, uh, Coach, we already got the win. I'm trying to take this. Trying to take it easy. That is going to be game. We're going to get a very, very solid bounce back win here. 48 to 20. The Jacob Eason breakout game was so, so, so close. I believe we got every single requirement needed but that one interception, which I'm going to blame on the holding call. I mean, we went from first and goal from the one, get the holding call, and it's first and goal from the 11. I think that's what it was. And then I tried just forcing something, making something happen, didn't happen, and turn it over. And just like that, we fucking, we fucking blow it. Which is uh, unfortunate. Unless EA blesses me and they're like, they're like, you know what? You did everything. Um, you threw one pick. I'll, I'll let it slide. But I doubt that's going to be the case. Which is which just sucks. Because that would have been so good for Easton's development, man. Superstar Dev in his second season. His sophomore year. I think it took me two or three. I think it took me three seasons last night to get Daniel Jones the superstar. So that would have been awesome. But... He played good today. He played good. Back-to-back -back games where he's played good besides, you know, last week he had the inaccurate pick. This game, you know, he played great besides the one that I made. I'm um, trying to force it. But 19 for 27, 396, three touchdowns. He had a rushing touchdown as well. Um, Reunion Moster, he did okay. JT didn't, didn't do too bad as well. 17 for 108. Um, Damian Harris had a couple solid runs. Got a touchdown late in the game. Mo Ali Cox, 8 for 141 and 1. Basically all of it on that one touchdown, the 70-yarder, but hey, or half of it was on that one. Michael Pittman, 5 for 101 and 1. Deontay, not that bad as well, 4 for 61. Um, other than that, I mean, besides the Paris Campbell nuke that we got, I mean, we didn't really need to pass too much. We were moving the ball pretty easily. Jabril Peppers had himself a game, 8 tackles, 2 tackles for a loss, a sack, and a pick 6. The dude was flying around making plays. We didn't miss field goals, which is something that, you know, always seems to happen. Um, but that was just a solid performance. Defense played well. Offense played well. I mean, we didn't miss field goals. I mean, it, that's just... We got to do that more consistently. And I don't think we're sitting at 9-4 and four if we do that consistently. I think, you know, maybe we're sitting at with one or two losses, you know, right now. Instead of having four. Um, we need a little help, though. We need a little help. Like I said, I'm not sure how the tiebreaker is going to play out between me and the Titans. Um, but we do need help. We need to uh, have him just drop one game because I'm not sure what the tiebreaker is. So it'd be nice if he could drop it this week against the Beals. Not sure if that'll happen, though, because Derrick Henry will probably just run loose and be an absolute freak. A little, little salty that I didn't get the Jacob Eason thing because we did everything besides the damn pick, which is just so sad, man. Even if he isn't a superstar quarterback situation installed, yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. We tried our hardest with him. Give me another chance next week, please. <laughs> Give me another fucking chance, man. Oh, man. All right. Well, with that win, we move to 9 and 4. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. And I'll see you guys in the next one.